Erdos belongs to Mongolia culture, uh, like Norman culture. Uh, we we can say tri- um, uh, local culture. But the local term come from mainstream culture, and the local people, I say the local government, they don't want to become local culture, right? They also want to merge into the modern culture. So I think they were in the crisis, uh, like uh, in the process of modernization, how they express themselves. I was thinking maybe we should just put something so abstract, uh, has no reference, uh, no reference to the time and the, and the other culture, just put there. Maybe something new will, you know, will, will come to this object. So, so we did this uh, a, a bubble or spaceship like form, look very futuristic. So it doesn't look belong to Earth or anywhere uh, in, in, on this Earth. So Erdos Museum is uh, just abstract object with a cut here. It's cut, so we want to make the building show the artificial treatment. But more important, the building is landed on the waving landscape. And here you can have a lot of people sit and walk at this. And here the entrance of the building, and you can go up from here. And we have two sunlight like this, one here, one on the other side, and inside is lobby. And the main building is solid because the cold weather over there. So during the day, you don't need any artificial lighting in this museum, in the public space. I see this building as a, as a generator. Mm-hmm. Uh, maybe something new will happen in the future because currently, um, you can say this building is good. It's belong to, to local or not belong to, to this local, but no answer. You don't know yet. Mm-hmm.